men like to see things while women want to feel and hear them to become the most seductive man one who will leave her wanting more and doing you all night you must understand how the female mind works spoiler alert it works a lot differently than men leaving most guys clueless this is the main reason why cheating is so common in today's world and most women chase the next high to feel something that turns them on but if you're an intelligent man a man who understands female nature and wants to give them an experience that'll make them flow an ocean out of their body Body, this is the video for you. Let's uncover the weakest spots that women want you to spoil, but they'll never ask for it. Beware, if you overdo these spots, she might get turned off and want to leave. But these six spots will make her beg for you, keep coming back to you, and be yours forever. She'll turn into a woman who will never leave you and keep you awake all night just to have you spice her life up. Fearless Forge for an ordinary man, a man who has no idea about dating, a woman's hair is just hair. But there's a deeper, darker secret behind how much a woman gets turned on when you touch her hair, specifically her scalp. While most people think that a woman's head just contains a bunch of nerve endings, that's totally wrong. It contains nerve endings that can stimulate her all the way down till she's drooling for you, wet as hell. Oxytocin is the most essential hormone for women, and it's also known as the love drug since it turns them on. The most common way to get her to release this hormone and get crazy for you is to massage her hair. This little trick will turn her from an innocent little bunny to a desperate, hungry woman who wants you all over her. So what do you do? As a man who understands female biology, you should simply start by sliding your fingers along the scalp. But beware, keep it friendly and gentle so she doesn't feel that you're too rough. Just like you do her down there, make movements with light pressure, make waves in her hair, and just play with her. In no time, you'll see her rubbing her legs, getting all needy and desperate for you. The female body is made in a way where the nerve endings go from her scalp to all the way down where it matters the most. By doing this, a true king will turn her on. But don't stop there. Women view intimacy as an experience. To give her the best experience of her life and keep her engaged, you must continue. That's where the power of earlobes comes in. As we've already discussed, women love to hear things. You can give her pleasure and make her climax just by saying the things she wants to hear. And this is where our second point comes in, which is one of the most prominent points of a female's body. But here, you must do a proper job or it'll ruin everything for her. While every woman is different from one another, you either want to hear nice things or dirty things. There's no in-between. You can either get close to her, and while you're in that moment, you can say the most wholesome things like your hair is beautiful or your body turns me on. But if your better half is someone freaky, you can whisper some of the dirtiest tricks you know. By mastering the art of whispering in the ear, you'll give her a braingasm, which is what most men fail to do. It's one of the best foreplay tricks to ensure that she'll want to do more and more, and at any point, she'll just give herself all to you. But if you want to take it to an advanced level, you can bite her earlobes gently, or kiss them, as this area is one of the most sensitive areas that a woman has. This'll not only make her needy for you, but it'll also send shivers down her spine, giving her butterflies in her stomach. Speaking of the stomach, the abdomen and the pelvic area are some of the most sensitive and brain-numbing experiences you can give to a woman. If you want her to just give up on everything and submit herself to you, then hear me out clearly, as this is the most crucial part. But why is this area the most important? You see, the abdominal area is connected with her central part, which makes the pelvis and her stomach very sensitive. Even light stimulation in this area could make her feel like she's in heaven and you're God. The abdomen area is also rich in nerve endings, so when you put pressure here or give it a little tap, it'll melt her brain, only increasing her desire and turning her on to an irresistible level. So how exactly do you stimulate the most sensitive area in a woman's body? You see, it's simple. All you need to do is slide your fingers onto her stomach while holding her from the love handles, and then making waves upwards, you'll give her an experience that she'll never forget, even if you're not together anymore. Not only does abdominal pressure stimulate proper blood flow in her central region, but it also sets a burning desire for you to do her with every fiber of your being. It builds connection. To reach the most profound, darkest fantasies of a woman, you must understand the importance of the nape. 
The back of the neck is something not a lot of men explore, and women don't even know this area can be stimulating enough to send a shiver down their spines. Instead, this area is often ignored, but if done right, you can become her perfect lover and give her an unforgettable experience. As a man and a gentleman, you can part her hair from the head and kiss her nape gently and then move up to her ear to say some of the most mind-numbing things. This act is wildly attractive for women since they get turned on by it a lot. Once you combine the act of kissing the nape while going through her ears whispering some of the dirtiest things, she'll give herself to you and you'll be in charge of pleasuring her however you want, whenever you want. Even your slightest breath will drive her crazy and she'll wonder about you all night long. By taking things to a further level, you can say tempting words as your warm breath touches her skin, giving her a pleasure unlike anything she's ever had before. And if the nape was an area that you weren't aware of, you'll be even more surprised to find out that the back of the knee down the hamstring, well, a woman is susceptible there. This is a place where women almost never get touched, even in their general lives, but that's a bingo for you because you, as a strong man for her, can take control of this area and make her experience extreme pleasure. This pleasure would be unlike anything since it involves a mix of tickle, desperation, and a unique butterfly feeling that all the women chase. By touching the back of the knees and moving to the thighs, you'll create a weird sensation that most women won't even be able to explain to you. However, it'll turn them on like crazy, giving them open legs for you, which is the ultimate mark of dominance for any man who wants to upscale their love game. Start by massaging your partner's knees and then sliding your fingers to the back. By massaging this area, it would be like you found another spot, which would only make her beg for you more. All women like to be touched in various regions, and the back of the knee is almost universal. The hallmark of universal erogenous zones has to be the inner thighs. You see, one of the most sensitive areas of a woman is the inner thighs. By touching the area well and rubbing your hands, sliding your fingers, you can not only make her needy, but very wet. Most men don't discover this area because they're unaware of the pleasure it can bring. It's almost like you're beating around the bush while ignoring the natural part. But beating around the bush makes more sense here. You're basically building up a massive anticipation for your woman, and she wants to get touched down there, but you're slowly massaging her, enjoying her tender skin and telling her beautiful things. There'll come a point where she'll take your hand and slide it right in. That is, if you're doing it the right way. If you act like a total virgin here, she'll sniff it out and call you out on your inexperienced riz game. As you rub in between her thighs, there will come a point where a woman would give her all, risk it all, and become yours just for the pleasure's sake. Not many women get to experience the true pleasure of rubbing the inner thighs, but the ones that do, they never forget and reach the climax much faster. As a stoic man, you must understand female nature. Once you understand that massaging a woman's scalp, nibbling her earlobes, putting pressure on her abdomen, kissing her nape, touching the back of her knees, and playing with her inner thighs can make her desperate and needy. You can get any woman you want for a long term without the risk of them ever leaving you. And to help you navigate through the complex world of dating, we have a few more videos on the way, so stay tuned and watch the next one.